guys and welcome back to my channel. If you guys are new here, welcome. I'm so happy that you're here. Make sure to subscribe down below and give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. Today I'm going to show you this new way of styling my hair. I don't know about you, but for the New Year's, I always like to just do something a little different, like me but here, if that makes sense. So I went blingy on the earrings. Um, eye makeup, I put glitter. There's rose gold glitter. And then for my lips, it's just a pop of something to bring everything together. Now that I just did a video, I'll put a little eye here so you can see it. But um, I showed you guys a video where I used a flat iron to curl my whole hair. This is kind of like a dumbed down version of that. Literally only curled two sections of hair, which is amazing. So all of this down here is still super straight but you can't tell and it looks great. So if you guys are wondering how I achieve this look, go ahead and keep on watching. All right, for the very bottom pieces of my hair, I'm just gonna straighten everything super flat. I saw this girl, she had a lot longer hair than me, let's just say that, but she straightened like all of her hair and then just curled the top two sections. So I'm gonna try that today and see how it turns out. All right, so personally, I'm hoping that this works out because this would make my life so much easier just straightening everything and then adding a few curls to the top. Unfortunately, with shorter hair, you do need to like style it completely. So no matter what, you're gonna have to like thoroughly run a flat iron through your hair. I mean, unless you have like perfectly straight hair, but I do not. My hair is quite frizzy. <laughs> All right, now that I'm getting towards this like mid shaft section of my hair, I think I might add a few curls into it just because I feel like there does need to be a little bit of movement. But let's flat iron the top and the bottoms. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm reducing some of the tees up here, but I'm also like making the ends come together at the end so they're not so frayed. Do you see the difference? Can you see that difference? <laughs> I'm gonna place it diagonally on my hair and then just curl just a little bit. run my fingers immediately through it just to get it a little loose. Let's keep it like that and move on to the next section. So for this one, I'm gonna curl, I mean straighten, one big section. Usually I would like, I don't know, make this like two or three sections, but we're gonna figure it out. So I'm gonna straighten these front pieces and I'm actually going to take them and straighten them forward. And that is just so that they fall more in my face rather than outside of my face. Just like that. I like how they're kind of falling. Do you see that in my face rather than, does that make sense? I haven't ever done it before, but I've been wanting to and I just keep forgetting every single time I go to do my hair. So I like this. So we're gonna go in there and straighten all these ends. 
and then we're gonna curl these front pieces. And curl everything away from the face. We're gonna leave that there and then come over to this side. Now that everything is looking like this, I'm gonna run my fingers through my hair. Really mess it around. All right, now I'm gonna go in with some texture spray. This is dry texture spray. And what this is, is it just separates your hair without adding like any weight, I guess. Um, but it just adds kind of like, I don't know, separation. That's texture. So this is the uh, Lux Ion Dry Texture Finishing Spray from uh, Sally Beauty. I'll put the link down, down below in the description. All right, now that that is all up in there, I'm just gonna add some teas but not at the root. I'm just gonna add it at the ends. And then I'm gonna finish it off just adding tiny little curls just at the top to add a bit more separation. Um, now that everything's moved around, I just feel like it needs a little something. So probably like three three to four curls on each side. All right, and then I'm gonna finish it off with the generic, the generic value products volumizing spray. This is comparable to the Kendra, the Kenra volume. Uh, you can get this at Sally Beauty as well. I'll put the link down below. So I like to just lift up at my roots, just adding a little separation. So that the curls are more bouncy. All right, there we have it. Something fun for the new year. I like the the separate part and like how everything kind of just I don't know looks really messy, but that was so quick to do. I don't know. I just really really like this. It's very different for me. Um, I hope that this helps you. And I'm sure that you can, here, let's do this. Let's flip it on this side and see what it does. Oh, that's cute too. See, you can move this all around. Have a little fun. Thank you guys so much for watching. This was so fun to just hang out and create with you. This is actually Christmas Eve for me, which is crazy. So I hope you guys had a very Merry Christmas and a very Happy New Year. And I'm so excited for 2019 to see where this new year takes us. So thanks for, for always joining along and supporting me and loving me and being a part of my family. I love you guys. 